Thompson and I'm the founder of a veterans advocacy movement called Launch You. Our mission is to inspire and empower corporate leaders to optimize the potential of veterans in the civilian workplace. We do this in three ways. Through data analytics, we measure the extent to which an organization's veterans workforce is aligned and misaligned with the work being carried out. Where there's alignment, there's happiness, productivity, and success. Where there's misalignment, there's stress. There's both personal stress and organizational stress. Secondly, we teach employers how to use an EEOC-compliant hiring technology that profiles jobs and aligns the right veterans with the right jobs the first time. Third, we provide an onboarding framework that significantly increases the likelihood of veteran engagement, productivity, and retention. So, you're a corporate executive. What if someone gave you a million dollars and told you you could spend that money any way you like as long as you spend it on your veteran workforce? What would you do? Would you really know how to optimize the potential of the veterans within your workplace? Probably not because you probably do not have the underlying performance data that tells you where the stress exists, the human stress and the organizational stress. Fortunately, a lot of research and effort is being devoted to close the skill and knowledge gap between military assignments and civilian jobs. It's super exciting to see what institutions like Syracuse University and groups like 100,000 Jobs Mission and ACP through their mentorship programs are doing to support veterans transitioning into civilian work. Today, educational institutions like Central Georgia Technical College and Texas A&M are doing groundbreaking work by building veterans campuses to fast track veterans and their family members into civilian jobs. And frankly, the greatest opportunity business leaders have today is to work hand in hand with educational institutions to this end. But this is just the tip of the iceberg. What lies below the iceberg is what employers need to be paying acute attention to because underneath the surface of skills and knowledge is what is steering the corporate ship all too often in the wrong direction, the manifestations of which are veteran disengagement, lost productivity and morale, turnover, and God forbid, emotionally deflated and injured human beings in the face of failure. At Launch U, we call what lies below the surface of skills and knowledge the hidden dimension of performance. And what is hidden here is what leaders must understand if they want their businesses to thrive and their veterans to survive. So let's get back to the data, because that's what we're going to find in the hidden dimension. Data is what you, as a corporate leader, depend on to make your best decisions. But did you know that you can capture and use the data that lies in this hidden dimension to predict with precision human performance on the job? I suspect you're thinking, it's one thing to measure performance. We've all had to learn to do that, right? But how can you use data to confidently predict and manage how your workforce is going to perform and deliver? Over the next few minutes, I want to share with you the best kept secret in corporate America today, which is a body of EEOC compliant human performance data, a global normative database that has been accumulating for over 30 years. So it exists. The data is there. And it is through the concept of work alignment that we are able to use human data analytics to impact our businesses and the lives of those who represent the heartbeat of our business in the most positive and transformational ways. So my goal is to inspire you and as many purpose-driven leaders and organizations as possible to participate in a critically important research initiative, optimizing the potential of veterans in the civilian workplace. It is through this research that we will surface the reality of what is going on with veterans in the civilian workforce today. The organizations who choose to sponsor and participate in this research will not only contribute to the welfare of veterans, your communities, and your country, but will also discover exactly where the misalignment stress exists within your workplace and how to improve the productivity, engagement, and retention of your veteran workforce. So what we're doing in our research at LaunchU is we're using the work style patterns process as a research methodology to conduct a reality check on current veteran populations within private sector businesses and to illuminate the extent to which veterans are in alignment and misalignment with their current work. 
Another way to put it, we're revealing the extent to which veterans are experiencing stress in the civilian workplace. We're also measuring the alignment and misalignment between veterans and the assignments that they held in the military. So talk about a vivid picture, a picture that we all need to see and understand. Think about it. Many veterans come out of the military where they were misaligned with their assignments, and the job they can most likely get is a job that will cause them continued stress. This doesn't have to happen. So back to the business. Once we see through our research exactly where the alignment and misalignment exists within the work environment, we are conducting focus groups with managers, employees, and veterans to fully understand the impacts of the misalignment from both the human and the business perspectives. So each sponsor organization will see with crystal clarity job-specific analytics that point exactly to where they need to improve their veteran hiring, onboarding, management, and succession planning practices. And through the focus groups, the cultural elements needing change will also become clear and visible. So a direct path for optimizing veteran productivity and engagement is now in your line of sight. I so hope this video has been inspiring and that you are motivated to reach out and learn more about LaunchU and how we can help you serve your organization, your community, and those brave and courageous men and women who are now facing a brand new challenge in their lives. And that is being welcomed home by you and me. What they experience has everything to do with the choices that we make and the extent to which we set them up for success. Please pick up the phone and give us a call. I look forward to our conversation.